What is going on everybody? This is Plix and in patch 4.5 we had so many new things come to Fortnite like insane This is so crazy all of the different things that Fortnite is adding to the game And one of the things in particular that I'm super super excited about is gifting skins I always was saying like man It'd be so cool if I could like trade skins with my friends kind of like trading cards or whatever, you know uh, And they are finally adding it. We're gonna talk more about that in this video. So let's check it out All right, so if you guys go to the settings and then go all the way to the right, you're going to see something that says gifting, and it says can receive gifts from others. Uh, so that is something that recently got implemented into Fortnite, and I am super excited about this. There was always something um, that I really wanted in this game, and that was primarily to like be able to trade skins. Like if I had a Skull Trooper skin, I could trade it for maybe your Red Knight skin. Something obviously that's... Uh, a bad example, maybe um, Red Knight skin for, I don't know, like Sparkle, Sparkle Specialist or something, whatever. But, um, and now you can finally do that. Well, you can't do it yet, but uh, in, the fact that they added that in there means that they plan on allowing you to do that. Now, how long it's going to take, they, um, they actually posted on Twitter in a response. They said, hey, you know, uh, we are currently working through this and it should be implemented shortly. So I'm guessing in the next week or so, you're going to be able to start trading with your friends um, different skins. Uh, I don't know if it's going to be kind of like a refund, like you can only trade like three skins, or if it's just going to be unlimited. If it's unlimited, um, that's pretty cool in my opinion because like it, you, could, you, you, you can start trading with other people. Um, who maybe maybe they don't care for a certain particular skin, and so they you know they're willing to to give up that really cool skin that, that they don't really care for for something that maybe you don't really care for and you can just keep doing that to different people and doing that with different people uh constantly uh, which is kind of cool and if you ever get tired of a skin if you ever like oh, i'm never going to use this again if someone else wants it you could trade it for a skin that you don't have um i'm really excited about this i know the first skin that i'm going to go for is probably the red knight skin i never picked it up and i wish i had um, and I'll probably be willing to trade like two or three skins for that. So let me know in the comments below, guys, uh, what kind of skins that you're looking to get uh, and trade for. The other thing that they added, which unfortunately I haven't gotten to play yet, but I'm really looking forward to it, um, is the playground mode. Uh, like I said, I haven't really gotten to play in it yet, but from what I hear, it's pretty cool. The only thing that um, people are complaining about that I can see is that you know on console you don't have aim assist now obviously um i i feel like this could be something that you know the developers maybe just kind of overlooked because you know they turned on friendly fire so you could fight your friends but um you know that and that works for people who are on mouse and keyboard but people who are not uh obviously they you know are used to aim assist they're used to uh aim assist kicking in at certain points so it's not as um it's not as useful honestly compared to, you know, if you're on a mouse and keyboard. So hopefully they, they allow some kind of aim assist. That would be cool. Um, but I'm still looking forward to having build battles with my friends and, and doing that kind of stuff. Uh, they also added, and I felt like this was kind of random, but they added this uh, dual, dual pistol, which is broken, in my opinion. It does like 40 damage per shot, shoots two shots, and it's super fast. It shoots like probably faster than attack. So and like 80 damage headshot. So like you can literally shoot it once and if one of those hits the body and one of them hits the head, that's like 120 damage just boom right there. Super quick. Um I don't know. I think they they need to nerf them. Like I in this game I I run through people like crazy with them and um but yeah. The other thing, and I don't know if this is new or not, but I mean, you, you guys can see this. I'm in a uh, eight teams of twelve, which is so it's like ninety six players all drop into the same lobby. But you have eight teams, and whichever team survives the longest wins, basically. But if um, if two teams are both alive at the end of the countdown, then it's like it goes based off of kills or something like that. It's actually a really really fun mode. I really liked it. Um, and I'd like to see some things that, you know, kind of similar to this, but like maybe like eight teams or, uh, 12 teams of eight rather instead. Um, I don't know. I think it's cool. 
Let me know what you guys think about all of these different things in the patches. I I like them, and I kind of don't like them in particular with these dual pistols. I think they're way too strong. But, um, yeah. Hope you guys enjoy the rest of this match. Thank you guys for watching the video. I appreciate it. And I'll see you next time.